many of them are finding refuge in other places. Back in 2005, when Hurricane Katrina hit New Orleans, hundreds of evacuees stayed in Omaha. In case that happens again, what's the city's response? 3 News Now reporter Nick Starling is live to tell us the plan. Nick? Hey there, Jen. Right now, there isn't a defined plan because the city of Omaha has yet to take a call to say that evacuees will come into the city. But that's not to say that the groundwork isn't being done just in case. Flights of evacuees came here. This is video from 2005 when that exact scenario happened. They stayed in the now demolished Civic Center with cots, blankets, food to help them out. Today, the Douglas County Health Department met this morning to go over plans. They say since there's a lot of unknowns, they don't know if anyone will stop in Omaha. We might get a call and have, uh, have to re respond in about 24 hours. So we have to be ready for that. The needs are, you know, we know, at least from the past, we know what some of the needs might be. We know. That spokesman Phil Rooney, he also says if evacuees come here, they would have to inspect the area they are staying in, the food, and find out what medications the people are taking. So it's a lot of work. Again, the city of Omaha has not got the call yet on whether or not evacuees will come here from Hurricane Harvey. But again, this is a big storm. It has a long way to go, and there's still time for the city to get those evacuees. We'll keep on top of the story as it develops. Reporting live in downtown Omaha, Nick Starling, 3 News Now.